the importance of extracurricular activities. When they um, graduate from Kingston, hopefully with a very good degree, they will be competing with other people who have equally good degrees um, and they really need to find some way of doing things that make, help make them stand out. At an event, after an event, I would just volunteer to do things like, you know, can I clean up after you guys? Do you guys need help with anything? I'd ask questions. I was genuinely interested and genuinely passionate and genuinely wanted to help and be part of a team. So the types of extracurricular activities that I would like to see, and I've been an employer in the past and these are the types of things I'd look for, would be things that show a student's ability to take initiatives, um, to start maybe um, start a society, um, chair a club, um, join a sports team, um, organise an event, do some volunteering, and um, anything really that gives them the opportunity to show and to talk about in an interview situation that they are capable of leading a team, working as a member of a team, and motivating both themselves and other people. At the time at university, I also did an industrial placement, which really um, gave me gave me an idea of what you know life was like outside university from a pro professional uh, perspective. Um, I was also student representative for the Faculty of Business and Law, so I'd attend various meetings, um, some meetings where the Dean was present, so I really got to express the views of the student body and represent the student community. Um, I was also an academic advisor for business and law school. that are going to do really well in this life, if you like, um, are the ones that can balance a whole raft of stuff and at the same time demonstrate that they're very capable of you know, the qualities that we're looking for, the leadership, the motivation, the team playing, the presentation skills and so on. So that's what I would say to all of our students, just get involved. Hi, my name is John Wells. I'm the owner of the Golf Plaza in Surbiton. Uh, what I have here is an indoor golf centre uh, with a simulated bay with over 100 golf courses to play with your friends, family, colleagues. hosted tonight is an event for Kingston entrepreneurs and the Kingston Chamber of Commerce just to introduce uh, a lot of non-golfers to the area. Uh, my name is Norman, uh, Norman Mangera. I am the treasurer of Kingston entrepreneurs, um, second year business management. I've gained experience on networking, I've learned how to network effectively, I've won a game of golf and I've had a fun evening. Mary has just given us a speech on how to present effectively and concisely. Uh, be prepared. Be prepared to uh, give before you take and network with new people. I'm Mary Langan from Newer Training and I specialise in presentation and sales training. Best networkers are the people who look out for other people. They're really well connected and they think about how they can introduce the people that they know to other people. helping you to deliver compelling, engaging presentations are to focus really on three things. The first is your audience and what you want. The second is the structure that you follow. And the third is adding impact through the way that you think about your content and you deliver your content. Your experience. You know, the great
great thing about your experience is that nobody else has them. They're unique to you. So that makes your story interesting. And that's about my lot. I run out.